I made somebody else my focus, and that focus was TT. You know, that was the theme for this entire basketball team. Players, coaches, staff all wanted to go out there and honor Tiana and her family in the best way possible going through this challenging time. And when they clinched the win, it was a, a very emotional locker room. You know, they FaceTimed TT, like you said, and, and I talked to Paige. You know, she has a strength presence inside, but she moves her feet so well, you know. Both of those post moves she has made, you've seen her gain advantage and leverage with her foot. Sanders has the weak side rebound. This is Brooks, and it's a three. And Texas Tech trying to get right. Here comes Brooks. Texas Tech has not been afraid to run in the early going. No, that's well said. And the, the flow has gone up and down the court. Brittany Brewer dumps that one down. And Texas Tech, after trailing in this game, third time from three-point land. This is Jada Terry circling under the bucket. And she reverses one up and in. Tide is just really cool to be able to, to share this with him and, and to be in the record books with him. But, you know, if you know David, this is the first thing I said. He probably didn't even mention it, did you? She said, no, absolutely not. You know, he just kind of expects her to come out here and, and play how she's supposed to play. So it's a really, really neat relationship, though, guys. 4-16 today. Yeah. Brewer puts it on the floor and rolls it in. Her shots there in the first half want to continue to do the, do the same here in the second and again speed up the tempo for that Texas Tech offense to get, make them force some shots, guys. Thank you, Jessica. Jan Ross won at threes. She's gotten threes. Uh, you know, with, uh, with the Lady Raiders, I think you're talking about strong. Dungey's young, but she's strong too for a guard. Rich's first field goal as a Sooner. Yeah, transfer, kind of getting in the game mode with the Sooners. Blair sticks a three.